Hello, Paul Hamilton here. Look, I wanted to show you talking photos, a great way of uh, taking photos and making objects and books and characters come alive. Um, it is 12 plus on the um, App Store, so please, it's for older kids because there's probably some inappropriate little terms and so forth that you can pick in the app. So um, really looking at probably secondary students for this app. But I want to show you, it's, it's a really magical app and I'll try and give some context of how we might use it. So when I open it, you can see here, I've kind of taken some photos of some things around the school. Um, there's a um, kind of a statue and I've got some artwork there and you can see just by the technology that we use, it's a great way of kind of animating photos. So let's choose one. I might choose Hazel in regard to my photo here. Uh, not that one, let's go back. Let's see if I can find. Actually, we might take one of the um, photos that uh, my daughter did in Procreate. Uh, let's do Groot. Let's have a little bit of fun with Groot. And if I select that, um, what we can do is we can actually record our voice over the top of Groot. You can see here, if I press adjust at the top, I've got a quick adjustment where I can actually select where the mouth and where the eyes are, and that will animate. And then I hit the ticky box and you can see that I can actually record my voice over the top. And it's really, really magical with what we can do. And so you're down the bottom here, you've got a whole lot of pre text, which is very commercial and gimmicky. But what you could do is actually record your voice. So down the bottom there, there's a record voice. I'm not going to do that because I'm actually recording my iPad at the moment. So I don't think it'll work. So what if we actually... Uh, you can see here the kind of the movement and the, the really realistic thing. So just say that our students were, let's go back and select another photo. Um, it could be a character that uh, the people have researched, uh, like a historical figure. And if I hit the ticky box here, now you can see here there's a little bit here. Uh, we could actually go adjust. And you can see that's done a pretty good job of recording where it is. And look, it could be a famous historical person that you're actually giving some information about the character. It could be what the character actually says from a different perspective from the book. Um, so if we go with a different character here, if I go back, we could select um, a character from an actual book. Uh, it could be a character from a range of different things. Um, and it's just a really great way of actually getting avatars speaking and characters from the book and kind of using different perspectives there. And you can just see how accurate and kind of magical it is for bringing photos to life. Just a quick tip too, if you actually select the detail bit, you can see there that you can really um, dig deep in regard to the, uh, almost like the rigging, I guess, or the animation techniques where you can really pinpoint different aspects of it. So you can see there, I can actually go and say, okay, that should be where the ear is. You can see a little preview at the top right hand corner and you can really drill down in regard to the parts of the book. But this is just a great way of kids drawing characters, bringing characters to life in a really authentic way. Paul Hamilton here, signing.